Actually, you don't need very much to start playing, you know? You really don't. But you do need to build a kind of critical mass. So I, I carry a lot of notebooks around. I make notes and I just kind of pull stuff in. Like, I'm doing a version of, because um, I work a lot for kids, mostly for kids, and I'm doing a version of Rapunzel this year. Well, last week I noticed in, in a paper um, an Asian girl who was a punishment had her hair cut off. So I kind of like pull in stuff which kind of feels to me that even though the story's very old, has kind of, you know, modern resonance. And then I just go for it. I get to critical mass, uh, which is probably quite close to the deadline. Yeah. And I go for it. And from then on, what I, what's noticeable there is I don't map out a scenario. I don't decide anything before I've actually done it. And I kind of feel like, in fact, I wrote this into a play once, that there are map people and root people, yeah? Mm -hmm. That some people need a map. And I'm much better with roots, you know? That I will go so far obsessively I return to the beginning. So I'm almost OCD about that. If, if I've got stuck, I'll go right back to the beginning and work very slowly through it because you can almost guarantee you will find the place where it went wrong, well, wrong, or where you got stuck yeah. much earlier than the point where you run out of energy, you know?